about the fused performance transmission install we did on a 72 El Camino. We took out the factory style turbo 350, which is a three speed automatic, and we put in a 4L 80E electronic four speed overdrive transmission. This is not only going to improve fuel mileage because you gain the overdrive in the transmission, but it's also a much stronger turbo transmission that can take horsepower of 800 plus if they decide to upgrade the engine any more than it already is in this vehicle. We're going to go to the top side and I will show you some programming options that you can do with this and the versatility of what you can actually do to change the performance of the vehicle with the transmission alone. So if you want to and we'll lower this vehicle down. Um, you can see here, real quick before we go down, this is the transmission that we installed. Um, you can see the wiring here that shows the electronics of it going through the floor and up into the dash. Once we get to the top side, you'll notice there's no interior. We're not quite completed with this vehicle, but I'll be able to show you the performance options that we can do with this transmission controller. All right, so now we're in the top side of our 72 El Camino that we installed the huge performance transmission in. This is the handheld controller I was talking about. It allows you to adjust all the different performance capabilities of the transmission, like your shift firmness, uh, your RPM of the motor when the transmission will shift, your speedometer calibration uh, based off of tire size, gear ratios, and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to power it up, and I will show you on the screen some of the different options that you have on this piece of equipment here. All right, on our main menu here, you have four choices you can choose from. You have a live data, you have the setup wizard, you have the advanced options, and you can also read error codes, being this an electronic transmission. It's kind of like a brand new car, where it will trip error codes in the system. You can read them and clear them if necessary. So what we'll do is we'll go down to the advanced option setup, push the enter button. Now this is where you can set your speedometer. You can do it based off of pulses per mile, which is signal sent from the transmission to the speedometer. You can adjust it in the next step. You can do a throttle position calibration. Now this vehicle is carbureted, but it does come with a throttle position sensor that hooks into the carburetor and the electronics of the transmission. You can do all your adjustments for that as well through here. You can do a tire size adjustment for the speedometer or a differential gear based off of what gears you have in your rear end. If you go down to more, there's also your maximum shift RPM. You can do a low speed shift, shift aggressiveness, or even shift firmness depending on how soft or how hard you want it to shift between gears. There's also a converter minimum and maximum lockup depending on when you want it to, uh, when you want the converter or converter to lock up in the transmission. And that's just a, just a scratch the surface of the things that you can do with this controller um, in the live data. Since we don't have this vehicle physically running and driving yet, I can't give you any live data feed. But it will tell you exactly what's going on with the vehicle uh, based off the transmission feedback while you're actually driving. I failed to mention earlier also is the consumer friendly uh, programming that this offers. Um, this is not something that we have to do at Drew's Garage. It will be an initial setup by us here at Bruce. But this box itself, the handheld, will go home with the customer. It's part of the product package. It doesn't stay plugged into the vehicle. They can store it in the glove box. They can store it in their closet, in their house. It is only needed to be plugged in only when making adjustments to the vehicle. And like I said, there are adjustments that any computer savvy, you know, mechanical friendly kind of person can do as long as you understand what it takes to, to make the adjustments to the car or what you're looking for. So this is part of the package. It goes home with the customer and it's, it's very, very easy to 